uh, man who in your life quickly tell us how did he get involved with you how did you get married how did you get him how did he get you out and where are you right now I'm telling you it's a generosity from God Alhamdulillah yes God, uh, he took you know, he took you know, my family, but he gave me alhamdulillah rabbil yeah. alamin this How man. How did he come to your life? Let's Quickly. say, Doctor Barisa, he know about this case, mm -hmm. okay? Mm -hmm. And he he chose to uh, to uh, go with me all this uh, long time in jail. He didn't leave me. He came to the manager of the jail, mm -hmm. and he said, I want to marry this lady. I see. Uh, in, you know, he met too, too much problems in his way, but mm -hmm. he was there for me. Alhamdulillah, at, le uh, at last we got married since and three days. Got, and you got out of jail? Yes. Last week? Last week, yes, alhamdulillah. And you're now trying to get in touch, uh, negotiate with your ex-husband. Uh, we need a few minutes, uh, Mr. Ali. Yes, we are telling him we don't have time. Okay. We have to okay. call it. Okay. Um, Fatima is out of jail right now. and. Uh, God has given her the chance and opportunity for a new marriage. A man who really is very rare in the whole world, a real uh, believer. Uh, they got married and she's now in the process to uh, get connection with her children. And all that happens because of her strong faith to God and transformation. We seek and we ask uh, her parents to uh, think about having a relationship with her and forgive her for God's sake because it, each Muslim duty is to follow God's order and God's order is when somebody repents we have to forgive. This is the spirit of Islam. Thank you so very much for all my callers who participated in this program. Uh, Mr. Mohammed Al Isa, uh, um, Abdul Aziz and Mr. Abdul Rahman. Thank you so very much thank for participating and thank you very much for Control Room. Until next week, God bless you all. Thanks.